I've got a present for you. Okay, okay, okay. Let's have a look. Uh, Legend is on the top left-hand side in Serbia, and Zas on the bottom right in Allied. Uh, I think this is the most preferred spot in um, in Heck. Um, obviously, the reason being, as you get down to these gems pretty quick as well, you can move your MCV as well. This bit here can be quite hard to get stuck in. Um, it's quite good if you're Soviet, if you can get your Rados forward and, and prevent that, but being Soviet should be okay, but sort of an SVS, sometimes you can get stuck going back and forward either way um i'd imagine um i think zas is, is an ally player that that likes the seals and the ngs that haven't watched zas too much if i'm honest obviously we all sort of know legend but uh even though zas is one of the sort of better a-class players um we don't see him in show matches too often probably leave it at that um so yeah no players making any mistakes uh predictions are up i think you've got about two or three minutes left legend at the minute just winning in on the predictions as well yeah yeah it makes sense um yeah i think that's there's a hundred hundred and three points in it in it now and see marco actually lost a, a two or three games there against players and obviously when you guys have so many points if you lose a game it's, it's big points that you do lose um the legend comes straight down here comes a seal Legend going to bring this miner down to here as well. Um, what is the target here? Can you get the war factory? Oh, that, that seal doesn't come out of a great position. He gets away with it. Oh, that power is going to be huge as well. This is huge. He might better get the barracks. Oh, he gets the barracks. Oh. A ref now comes out and needs to get... Um, Super dog. There's a dog in here doing work, wasn't there? It does get a uh, a vet rider, but if we look now on the, the mine account, one, two, three, four, five, six. Six miners, so he's one, two, three, four, five. So he's a miner ahead. Um there's the lab up. So that's not going any pressure behind there. He's gonna go for his BFs. Brings out another miner as well. He's bought himself lots of time here. It's a decent lead here. Very decent lead here for, for Zass. He's going to need to get a ref over to here as well. Surprised he not tried to move the MCV because obviously going for the lab. Yeah, I suppose there's no need to do so. Get that lab up. And uh, the War Factory's out for Legend. His eco's going to be good. Obviously not producing Rhino for a little while. Um, he'll be saving that eco. So should see a, a second ref, a third ref um, coming down onto the third level. So we've got one up in here, one up in here. Should see a ref into here, then we should see a couple of war factories probably behind that. Um, pushing into the middle and trying to take center control. So game's not over and done with yet, even though there's us with a huge um, huge seal there. Really slowing Legend down, but Legend with the, the Rhino, some dog putter in there as well. So the minor count, one, two, three, four, five, still five versus one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Could be nine. I think it's nine actually. This BF will just force his opponent back. I can maybe see a spy or another, or a seal or a Tanya. Just, just keep going with them. Legend just going to try to split up his rhinos as much as possible. That's the weakness for the BFs. Comes there in mobility. Does come into this BF here. Forces back. Doesn't go in completely. Comes back. Some uh, rhinos being loaded down the middle. That's just has the micro well hit with the BFs. And the chronosphere is out.
Let's grab a miner. I do believe there was a miner grab there. Definitely is one now. I'm interested that he only has one of the BFs. Not too sure I like this from Zas too much. Uh, just obviously going to wait out for this Chrono. Not sure. I, I'm always playing Mirages myself. Um, I, but that's mainly because I don't have the control over my BFs. It takes a, a lot more skill. Um, but what I see... Um, I, d I don't know anything about the, the Legend Andy, Andy matchup. Two BFs that side, three BFs that side. Uh, still loaded in the middle. This uh, this first chrono is going to be hard. It's going to keep Legend pinned back as well. Nice use of the Siege Choppers, doesn't get them right into position though. Siege Choppers could have maybe worked, but yeah, it wasn't in position there. Coming down the side, does lose one BF. Uh, GI is getting some work done as well. That bunker goes down as well. In his base, this is GG chat. Uh, it's kind of hard to follow slightly because uh, the Zast is all over here on Legend. GG is cool, that early seal oh, yeah. here did so much work and that's making that look really comfortable to be fair much appreciated larry obviously with the sponsor for this show match um yeah and this is a decent prize pool as well for for these two players um much appreciated from apple drop larry as always and it's Zassalan on the top left hand side and legend on the bottom right um I had this map vetoed actually. Um, I think it's I think it's a good map. I have no issues with the map. Uh, I know there's been issues about the gems here if you play Yuri on that spot, but I think it's a really good map. But it, I think it's a decent skilled map is what I always refer to it as. Um, it's not a simple map where you know things are just obvious and easy to do. And yeah, I need to, to have a good build order here. I think it's the point I'm getting at. So, um, but I prefer the spot the legends in rather than Lar uh, I called him Larry then Zas. Sorry. Um, both players have gems to start with. Patch here and patch here for Zas and Legend on the bottom right. Start with these gems up on here and also got a scatter over here as well. All factories are out. Oh, top left is 10 times better. Okay. And say so I don't have this um, this map played. I always thought that people referred to the bottom right spot as better. <laughs> yeah, that's a super strong, but you can watch him play on stream. They can sacrifice twenty grizzlies to get a seal to kill a war factory now. Um, yeah, Sanchez swing six four earlier. Um, Andy calling that uh, if if Zas lands a seal here, he wins. The bunker is there; it needs to be full, which it is. This ref is 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 pointless. Yeah, it forces the the sentry. That's nice. The opportunity to where he can land a seal is is difficult in a minute. Um, Legend with some fairly easy defense against it at the moment. Got the sentry in next to the power. The bunkers out as well. Close the bridge. What can I click on the fucker? There we go. Uh, so Spy out as well. So spy out as well. And a BF out as well. I like this opening from Zas. Although we'll need to get something done. And we see on the right hand side that the uh, spy is coming. He's going to try to send it downfield.
Oh, doesn't land it, doesn't land it. Did he land it? I think he might have. I think the Cody come out. He needs to bring over the... Um, still has this available here as well. Can maybe get into that power plant as well. BFs are out as well. We'll defensively hold this easy. He did land it on the barracks as well. And these BFs are going to be absolutely fine. Need to take care of these. Does eventually lose one. Oh, the battle lab. Let's go down. Let's get the battle lab. That's not too bad. But, uh, the Spires is pretty big, chat. Uh, doesn't want to lose a couple of miners here, though. These two are a little weak. Doesn't need to just bring over the BFs or the GIs. Cool. This is quite big, though. This is quite big. Three miners go down. Three miners and the BF goes. Uh, and the. Uh, the battle aft goes down with one of the BFs as well. So that was a quite nice counterplay from Legend, but um, yeah, you'd have to fear with that spy going in, it's going to be difficult. Having said that, though, it's it's one war factory with no battle lab versus three and a radar out for Soviet players. So uh, Apple drop, Larry. to get these BFs to work. Power, defensive power drops are coming in on nice. They're using the service depot to repair some rhinos back at base as well. NG IFB as well to help. Oh, just going to be careful we're going to lose this. Oh, it keeps that alive somehow. And only really takes one tick of... a couple of ticks of help. Going to move the, uh, the MCV. Drone is out. Drone is an easy counter for this. Yep. Let's go down. He did a double. Yeah, I'm not Zas as big a fan, to be fair. I haven't had him on the, the stream prior, but. Gonna go for that war factory, and there is no MCV, so that is it. These four BFs. Um, needs to go for Rockies here. And that one's one tick of health. As well. The Rockies are coming, Harriers. These four uh, BFs. Here's some Rockies coming as well. It's going to be really, really difficult. And he isn't a timer here with the IC. Oh, go for that IC. Oh, can he get the Rockies on it? I mean, oh, no, he can't. Porsche comes in, Zas is going to win this. I think Zas is going to win. Just needs to kill that flak. Using the miners as fodder to help. When Guts gets the battle lab, an elite flak, and one BF left. And the IC is now going to be ready. He gets an elite BF, though. Needs some Harriers. Good four Harriers at base. Bring the Harriers. No, he's going to lose the BF. No, he keeps the BF alive. How much health has it got? Oh, it's still four. He wins. GG. Wow, what a game. And ask him what happened to the MCV. Definitely our level will just go mirages, won't they? Uh, you don't see a great deal of BFs. Um, Snark is one player that stands out that will go BFs. Quite often he likes the um, the BFs and the, and the chrono. So is that land in the bottom spot here? Versus the top left hand side. So, um, Zas not getting um, the joys he did first time on a heck with a seal, but he did force lots of defensive structure. But what it allowed for the distraction for the seal to, uh, for the spy to come in, and the spy on the barracks allowed for the GIs and GGIs in the BFs as well, make them a little bit more stronger. Uh, he's going to put his war factory up here. 
There's the wool factory. It's not completely full. One off the Connie, but I think that's okay to take down that seal. Uh, this is Yuri's Revenge, so NGs can um, capture buildings. So NGs can capture buildings. Which is obviously different to the, to the RA2. Brings out a flak. I didn't think I saw anything in it. So this is just a. There comes an NG. So um. So Legend gonna do some uh, shenanigans himself. And just as the question was asked about the NGs, here they come. So here comes the seal. That first right arrow shot misses. Could come up to the barracks. Let's get the barracks and then deploy. Can keep that alive. NG is there. Needs to make sure he sells rather than losing anything to an NG here. Oh, he loses the war factory. He loses the war factory. Bounce comes out as well. You know, maybe an NG coming out of there, take that ref even, but uh, yeah, could just force Connie's here. There's uh, big trouble here for, for Zass. Sentry out as well. And this one is going to be a GG. Seal up in the top one. Need to land something very big with that seal for this to work. Yeah, it's still being forced away from the rhino. It's on the top right hand side going over to the ore patch. Four rhinos here. Gonna go for that MCV. We will get it. Needs to deploy. Just a war factory does come out. Seal coming back home. And he can just keep base walking. Comes over to the rhinos now. Seal gonna go down. Seal does go down. It's gonna ult onto the war factory as well. It's gonna be a GG and it's gonna be two games to one. Legend with his own NG this time. And GG is called. So bottom left spot here is Legend. Top right hand side here is Zas the Lamb. There, Connie comes out. Gonna go straight to the bunker. So two games to one. Rick's name is massive across the screen. Um, prefer when you get the, the rep into here so you can start walking down further like Zass has done. I'm not sure that was a mistake from Legend or if he purposely has put that there. Maybe early on want to keep his base a little bit more compact because of the seal. Here comes the NG IFE. So flak out. We see another NG again here from Legend. He does NG of his own. So you want two uh, two GIs in an IFE to, to count that counter this really. Doesn't land the NG. Doesn't land the NG. Gonna move his MCV now. Uh, but this NG of its own. MCV removed into the middle for Legend here. Oh wait, couldn't just run that over. That NG came out, waypointed back here, and then tried to walk all the way to the war factory. He wanted that radar really, but yeah, the NG shut out. Um, so I'm going to try and press the power here. Needs a pillbox out. Does need a, just needs it, unless he's loading for the cannon, but just wants a pillbox here. I still think he's trying to load for a cannon. 
a rocky as well would be nice. There's a cannon. Back of this. So two miners back at home. In the middle, we have two miners on gems as well, which is massive. Back in uh, Vassan's base, he has one, two, three, four, five, six miners. Let's have a cannon in his base. I might see a seal here. Got to get a miner. Legend all over here on Zas. Let's get that rep as well. We'll defend now. Pushes him back. But uh, legend in the middle with with two miners. Hey, water. It's been a long time. Doesn't land, doesn't land, and you'd have to think that um, Legend is in complete control of this game now. Big World Batteries versus one, and um, Zass is broke. He is on five miners. Five miners does play four, but two of them miners on gems, and there'll be a rep shortly coming into here, which will then put him three miners onto gems as well. Um, the gameplay here of what Zaster likes to do is the seal and the NG, and neither of them have worked so far. Should be able to get himself an eco boost here. He wants to get a cannon somewhere into here. But um Legend might just, just chill and um push now for the for the IC. He is broke legend. He's getting his eco going now. Four miners in the middle. Seal is out. There's the cannon that comes up here. Seal being shuffled down to the bottom left hand side spot. Probably take some chip damage off that bunker as well. Service Depot out. There we go. There is a sentry there. I mean, he spent so much money trying to get a war factory. Uh, the ref isn't a bad target there, you know? Um, even though Legend's eco is decent, um, would, would mean these two miners would need to move or force another ref down, but. It doesn't look like he's going to be able to get much joy. Trying to get an in and out mission. Um, goes down. Uh, that's in big trouble there. He's trying to distract them as much as he can with his grizzly, wasn't he? But probably, a, um, probably just lost the game there for sure. Even though there's cannons in here, they would. Second MCV is built and the Grizzlies just go right into the rhinos here. Let's force them back with them cannons, but. So there's a second MCV. Kirov reporting. Kirov could be nice here. Just so many uh, rhinos, and, and really for me, Legend just could just wait for the IC here. Double gear off coming as well. This is going to be hard to defend against. Really hard. I see it sticking down. Kind of move that in some way. Should be able to defend against that, okay? It does. Here comes the push. Could have waited for the IC. Feels like he doesn't need to. Um, I don't have evidence he doesn't need to. Needs to sell up here and just come back, but yeah, this IC can, can finish the game for sure. There'll be no four shield or anything as well because we have no battle lab. Uh, MCV has now been moved back as well. Can get to them gems as well. That's nice from Legend.
Here comes a seal. A bunker is there. Oh, that seal comes so far away. He could have got that. He could have got that. Um, would it have made any difference? Absolutely not. Another MCV coming out. Um, I don't think it would have made any difference at all, but he definitely could have got that. I'm not sure where he's going with his grizzly. He's sending them on a, on a suicide mission. Uh, Zatsaland suicide mission works again. And he's going to come up to the right side. Zatsaland trying to hold on in here, but um, it is a GG. An absolute GG. Once this all here is done, um, there, there's no all left on, on the map for Zats to mine unless he's brave and and comes into here or comes into here and just not going to be allowed that opportunity to do so and Legend is going to come down here on the bottom right hand side here as well take them gems as well, moves the MCV and a cannon comes out but can just start see at any point here if he wants, cannon goes down there does still have the MCV back at base but that's maybe just making Legend play some time out and make him work for it but Legend probably sat on the back of his seat right now, very comfortable, very relaxed. Still has this IC. I would, I would build a second nuclear reactor if I was Legend, just as a precaution, although I haven't said that now, there's, there is two bunkers there, so... I don't know where Zass is going to go and send these Grizzlies up again, isn't he? GG called. Tech building capture. Right, so this is Jamel. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, Soviet versus Allied again. So Legend up on the uh, top spot. I'm um, starting with a nice patch of gems. So initially from this spot here, you can move your MCV down to here and take these gems on the bottom side here. Move your MCV onto these gems, a big patch as well. Um, have this building here that repairs your tanks. Um, and this one here is your, your power. Um, so players may look to, to, to try and take them off for one another. Already see the, the walls going around for the two players. So the bunker comes out. Legend knows that uh, the Zass is going to come with the seal. Legend has a lot to practice against seals as well. Because obviously um, him, and, him and Andy have played lots of show matches over the years. And, and Zass has a, a very similar game style plan. Um, well, I suppose with the seals and the NGs, I suppose that's... That's that's one of the similarities. Has already loaded the bunker. That was the mistake that happened on the heck on the. Uh, it wasn't a mistake on the opening game where one dog uh, was able to take care of some of the dogs and the coddies that come out, and that bunker wasn't able to be loaded up. Camp the dog on the barracks. MCV has been moved, so he might look to dog block here. Seal ready. He will be able to get over and kill that dog with a seal. Uh, Legend here. Not interested now. The MCV move by Legend has taken place as well, so a ref will come into here. We shall see a ref into here as well. Now you can get uh, rhinos and grizzlies up into here as well to, to, to harass the miners. Do the same this side. Not quite as effective as, as you can do on some maps. Um, Reconal is, is a map that you can do a similar thing as well. Uh, Divide and Conquer where you can shoot down on the cliff from that ore, but... Um, That's what I lost. It's had a mini panic that I completely lost that seal. Uh, so ref would be nice. MCV is oh he's got it in control attacked. Okay, four rhinos. One rocky would be nice. Just one rocky chipping away. Uh, Battle lab is up. Interesting placement for the power drop. Raj comes out. I'm not sure where Zas is going. He's just going to sacrifice this. Deal goes down. Not sure why Zas just left this. Loses two minus for it. Four is going to come in, but we'll get absolutely no joy unless he ults. But then he should just shoot the ground. But he could just go take care of that. I'm not sure why he he just let the two minus die and then lost these grizzlies. sure what it's just controlled attack them as well which can never be a good thing sometimes with the mirages reinforcements coming in here power drop up on here um, 
No mirages are coming. I haven't seen a mirage. There we go. I need to get over and kill these. Let's just save the wall factory. It needs to kill that bird. No, it doesn't. Two rhinos up in the cliff there doing some work, but I'm not too sure what happened to Zas there. I'm not sure he made this. I'm not sure he made this actually. He's gonna try to come over to this side here. I've got some mirages chasing over that side. Drop for the power of nice. to move these GIs. Chronosphere is out when a Tanya is out. Pretty confused in the gameplay here from Sass. Not, not liking what he's done in this game here. There's two miners. We get these miners over here onto this ore. Could lose the MCV here. You could just take that MCV. I'm not sure there's a four shield. Four shield comes out, but he has to get over there ASAP, otherwise it's uh Let's sell it off. This is the battle lab. Battle lab and one war factory versus one, two, three, four, and a radar as well. Hmm. Yeah, this this uh, just doesn't have an execute with what you want. They did very good at the minute against the uh, the seal the last couple of games as well, and yeah. And Tanya is out. He has a chrono in three and a half minutes, but what he chronos is is going to be the issue here. Some Rockies are out. He's these uh, Harriers to, to shoot the flag. These choppers coming in as well. Nice little counter. Tries to go for the nuclear reactor. Or the battle lab. Let's get the battle lab. I see came out. I see came out as that battle lab come up. Might get the radar. Black coming around to support. They got that IC up. Um, and and having said that, how important is that IC? I, I don't think he'll he'll need the IC to win this game anyway. I don't see anything in his base to defend here. Barracks now goes down. Could just go for that BF. Puts him uh, the low power he's shooting out as well. BF doing some work though, but no idea gonna be enough. And there we go, chow. GG called. GG. Tech building captured. Legend has proved uh, before that he, he has a very good ally. So it is Zasalan in yellow as Soviet. Zasalan playing as Soviet here. On the right hand side, well, the bottom side here is, is Legend as Allied. Gotta look for a double NG here. Double NG. I can't, I'd be shocked if Legend isn't aware of that. You just need a century, and that's a thousand you've spent. Oh, he's gonna get it. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. So he does get it. And do you see players Trump sometimes do that? Load up these bunkers. So, Southland spending a thousand early. This is a really poor ref place. I mean, it's because he didn't get a scout on this side. Um, so, that's some of the issue you do that. If you build a double NG at the start, um, by the time your dog get over to scout, they're in a. Um, it, your ref is already ready. So, he's had to place the ref back here. Uh, but he, he did get the oil, though. So, so Legend as allied. Does he go for a seal here, or does he go for NGs, or will he play. An old school build and keep it simple. We shall see. Black comes out now. It's probably going to be an NG in there, so you'd, one would have to imagine. He does. He forces that cell. This is really nice. He needs to click it and gets the power as well. Doesn't get the barracks, but another ref does come out. 
So inevitably not the worst there, loses the power. But the pressure should keep coming though. It's moving the MCV. This is a really good start here from Zas. NGIFE now. Oh, and the drone is there. The drone should get that. Trying to get that miner. Drone still not made it there. It just doesn't doesn't need to deploy the MCV and allow that opportunity. Now it does get it. Not sure if any miner has been taken yet. Once that, once that, look at these two miners. Just absolutely, he holds. That's huge. Two miners, so weak. They're pushing that MCV. Got to finish the job here, Zaf. He's, he's he's lost three games in a row here, so his confidence will be low. I would love to see him if he could get these miners, but the GGI there. Look how weak that is. Oh, uh, this is nice though from Legend. He is defending. He is getting himself back in this, but uh, the MCV moving a ref down to there. Going to try and move the MCV. Um, that's going to be pretty brave because he won't have the luxury of the GGIs and the pillboxes around to defend. Three rhinos coming over. Three rhinos versus four grizzlies though. One of them. Well, these are weak as well. He needs to be careful here. He needs to be careful. Drone comes out. Going to be a little bit too slow. Need a sentry in here. So if two rhinos come over to harass. Three miners versus three. Not going to get the MCV though. Don't think he'll get the MCV. He needs to repair it. Or oh, doesn't want to lose the MCV. He needs to repair it. He does lose it. He does lose it. He had two, two and a half, three grand day. I think he should have saved that for sure. Sorry, I haven't kept up with chat. Look at your comments shortly. Um... Legend was broke. I thought he still had a, a grand or two in the bank. That's, I don't. I don't think he sold off the MCV. Maybe it might have been the case. But yeah. Pressure here from Zas has been really, really good though. Gets an elite as well. Elite does go down. Um, drone comes in. Lo lovely drone as well. And it takes the NG as well. And um, that's almost like a snake around Legend now, isn't he? He's just going to constrict him. Legend says they'll do. No GG called. Not got an underscore. Um, so Zas goes back to Allied Legend on Soviet here. Um, Proving Grounds, really, really nice map. So you get the power into there and the barracks into there. You can do you move up until here as well. Let's see Legend over on this side as well. So start with four oils, two oils there, two oils there. Lots of gems. A really wealthy map. Um, she'll see how Zas plays it. Does it go mass grizzly? Because well, he does push that early battle lab. Um, Legend gonna rule his MCV, which I which I like. I like that. That's just one less thing you have to worry about with the uh, NG or the CL early on. Oh, the minor fuck, 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 fuck. Didn't get his ref in the right place. Look at that chap. Look at that chap. Didn't get that ref in the right place. So he'll go for a war factory and then he'll go for, for the ref and sell that off. He should be sell that off straight away to get that miner out because the war factory would have been late. So he'll he'll sell that now. Um, he, he would have obviously noticed. Yeah, he wants to get that miner to work now. So he's, his eco is going to be behind here and NGIFE. But this is not a good start here from Legend. Double NGIFE kind of come out. Now he needs to be careful of the drone. Once he get his two NGIFEs together here. The other one is not with it. He's going to want to get near this pillbox as soon as he can. He doesn't, though, in time. That does keep the uh, NG alive. It does capture the oil on this bottom left-hand side. So now goes the five oils versus three. He's going to come over for this upper NG as well because he's kept that alive. And we see the, the rhinos coming out. But he has gone zero here, legend. NG um, flak of his own coming in. Gonna try to capture that oil back. 
I trust them with a prison. Obviously that was what was ready. Just gonna just gonna take it there. Doesn't. GRP still alive. The force another century. Legend on six and a half K. Zas here on ten K. Still one war factory, but does have now the the battle lab up. I've got one here. It's going to come into this right hand side here. It needs to get over there as well. Doesn't want to lose that lab early. That's quite a good condition here, having that lab. If he was to lose that, going to maybe look to just take care of an oil here. Loading the BS. I'm not a fan of this. Not a fan here of what Zas has done here. It just allowed him to have this expansion on the top right hand side here. And take the power as well. And then can really snoop an oil as well. And I'd like to see him just bring them Griffies over with the prisms and he would have been able to hell that. Now it takes a power as well. Two war factories here. Rick saying absolute schoolboy error. Yeah, and he now loses the oil. At one point in this game, he has five oils. Uh, he's down to two now. Um, there is a decent amount of rhinos coming over this other spot side as well. He's going to lose this as well. And he actually loses that fight. He does get an oil. Um, but down to one oil now. And the issue is with the expansion. So you look here. Legend has got this expansion. He can move his miners into there. Uh, no expansion. So only a small amount of gems have been taken. He might die by the MCB here. Doesn't just baits in some grizzlies. That's game. That is game. Tries to run and he does save it. He does save it. I'm not sure how he saved that. That must have been the the ultimate one tick of one tick. Uh, but it doesn't really matter. Still free war factories and the expansion with the gems as well. Legend is rich on 8k. Um, Yeah, needs another BF to come out. Now switches over to Mirages. On two war factories versus four. Do we think there's any way here for disaster? Yeah, I don't think so. Oh, and it was on one tick of help that BF as well. No NGIP to help that as well. Oh, that's nasty as well. You hate to see that. And now he's going to mind all. Would be nice that. That would be really nice because it would chain react. Not going to get it. Really nice uh, control there from Legend with that Rhino to be fair. Made that uh, look very easy. Which uh, I guess it is but yeah I don't always execute that too well running over 20s or GIs. Um, the Necron's asking Mr. Deeb if he's watching. Let's force him back and holds for now. He needs to repair. He has money, but he's going to come over this side. And he's just going to keep splitting him up here, I think. They can't really engage here, even with these grizzlies. Nice. The range of that prism is nice, but losing miners. Down to one miner. Um, power drops over that side to try and defend. Um, I think a really smart thing here for Legend... Would, would just be just to come and kill this expansion. Like, he's just got GIs over there. Uh, if Legend... If, if Sass wants to come out with these Mirages, then they're a lot more vulnerable as well. Um, I think Zass just needs to buy himself another minute here and come unscathed against any real pressure. I mean, I could would just go fight these Mirages. There's not that many Mirages I saw. There's, there's a hell of a lot of Rhinos. I think he could just go and say, let's going to load the, uh, the Deso Bomb, but... Need to wrap up here desperately. Eight, eight, nine. So nothing's been built at the minute. Don't think this is an engagement he wants to take. The legend should just push that. The legend should just, just go run straight through that. Don't even worry about the Dessos. All miners now are that then gems. We'll give him a huge eco boost. Could probably do with, with another sentry or two here as well. 
One, two, three miners down there. Four, five, six in total. I don't know where these miners here are going. Needs to get onto these gems. Man, Zach's just trying to get himself back into it. The BF being loaded over that side. But you're just going to try and pull Zass out here. I and mean, there's just not enough Mirage anyway. I just literally don't think he needs to even bubble with Odesso here. You just drive straight through all of that. I literally just drive straight through. There you go. There we go. Yeah, kill the MCV. It's just probably half the Mirages to Rhinos. Maybe even. Even if there, there was that many Mirages, I'm not sure. And, um, yeah, that's just. A little split on the right hand side here. One, two, three, four, five. Um, I suppose once you've got BFs on the field, you, you've always got half a chance. Well, I suppose uh, he's eight and a half K, has a barracks, has a war factory, has a battle lab. These choppers will come out. I had the score at 3 3. Uh, Zass won that to make it 3 3. I think. Yeah, Zass won that to make it, I believe. Uh, once he moves the seashell position and then the rhino is just going to absolutely look at this <laughs> look at this needs to go back <laughs> uh, very nice from legends an elite comes out of course an elite comes out that's over yet so left hand side here is legend he's playing soviet in red uh, tiburon nice map as well um, sometimes we do see players move their MCV early here um, onto the gems. Traditionally, we see players build and, um, and build down to the ore. Um, and then when they get to that mid to late game, we'll, we'll then look to move their MCV. But um, you can do it early. I'm not so sure how viable it is. Um, obviously, a Soviet would leave you vulnerable here to, to Zass's um, seal. Do we have any players that do move their MCV early? Oh, I think the miner initially came out onto the all there. Rick Sands, that should do well here. Uh, Larry's still with us as well. So MCV has been moved. There's no bunker at present. He, and he knows it as well, Zass. He wants the dog block. Uh, he wants the, the dog to stay here, so... Um, yeah, definitely a good decision to take care of that dog because he was waiting for that barracks to, to be loaded. Loaded up with... Um, with Connie's coming out of it to load up the, the bunker, sorry. Um, so it does come early on a double NGIFV. Not sure what work you can get down here. That bunker is there. Yeah, that's one that goes down. Double NGIP that doesn't work here is, is quite big. Does get this? Um, but I, I literally don't think it's enough at all. Not an issue there for the legends. We've got another ref. We'll probably have one ready. Um, the ref up here went down though. How did the ref up there go down? Wait, how did the ref up here go down? What did I miss? He sold that off. Okay, okay. Say so the NG... With that bunker there, I thought he may have been okay. So that's actually not too bad. He, he lost both of his refs. Um, so he hasn't got all of these gems here as well and, and forced to build another one down here. And we probably will want another ref up here at some point on the back of this. Have a look. Power drop going to come in. Uh, we have two runners on the field. This is a nice power drop. No need to go and do anything stupid. Throwing it into here, throwing it into here. Just walk the power drop forward as well. Drone does land. Drone lands. That's and he might get. Does he stuff it? He does. He does. Okay, that's good. Was that? So we'd have lost two two grizzlies there to a drone. 
Uh, so here comes the lab. The lab is out. Yeah. AFK power drop. I think I'd like to see um, a, a move here from Zas, maybe. Uh, he's going to try and flip and push, but by the time he does, you'd think there'd be a BF out. One BF should hold four. He'll need that BF to come. Four rhinos, there it is. Um, and he'll be fine there. He'll be able to hold. No problem. Um, Zas isn't going to be able to get any of his own joy himself. Power drop coming in. I imagine there'll be a prism ready as well, knowing Zas. The BF's only got two GGIs in. But it does lose it. Want to keep these GGIs alive there, he's going to lose them. Need to deploy that as well. It's going to lose this prison. That saved the battle ammo. Um. The two grizzlies there were left. I'm surprised that was able to do so much work, but taking the time to mocro and load up and BF. So a bit of a um, a bit of a rough opening four minutes. Both these players, I don't think, will be overly pleased with with their start. Um, two war factories, four and a half minutes in. Bad lab up with one war factory. Um, three power plants have been built over to this side as well. I wonder if you'll go an oil purifier or what be the plan. Needs to get these BFs together. Legend just doesn't have the Rhino to split at the minute. Three BFs here, they absolutely should be fine. I'd absolutely push, he might get a minor. Let's get a minor. Thank you, Rick. Not sure what he corona had. I pressed space bar and it went into here, so I'm guessing. Did he try the MCV chrono? I think he missed. I pressed space bar as soon as that hit. So I'm, I'm guessing he tried to chrono the MCV maybe, because that was where it sent us. You'd think he'd try to chrono the MCV into the water, which didn't work. A service depot was out. Um, alternatively, maybe could have tried for a couple of miners, but. So I don't think yeah, the chrono landed anything. So now we're going to see the splits. So uh, there's only four. I would just send them the F straight into there. Um, but nice move from Legend here. Zas could have really done with that that, uh, that Chrono landing something. So he's going to split up here. Free way here from Legend. He needs to move a BF over. Free BFs for four Rhinos. Not needed. A couple of reinforcements now coming though. The Legend getting ready here. How well can you control your splits? Is the key. He's going to lose one. Oh, it does keep it alive for now. Legend all over him. And he loses everything. Legend losing a lot there, but... Um, hasn't got any joy yet. The BS have gone down. And that was quite good for Zas, actually. I was concerned there. I was concerned. He did lose a few BFs, but... Uh, the, the key now is, is is this he needs to get someone from the chrono but I'm not sure what he can chrono he needs to bring a BF over here I think Legend's in, it's still in a decent spot here for sure he has complete map control but he, he needs a he needs a really good chrono here oh, he runs him straight in there I don't know if there's anything in this I'm trying to go for that MCV there's nothing loaded in that Wait, did the Tanya just kill the BF? Uh, the, the battle lab. What had happened? There we go. You click that. You can click on the miners. Click on the miners and the rhino. Okay. I'm so confused. Okay, maybe, maybe not. Where's the navy? I don't think I've ever seen navy on this map, but... Uh, 
A dreadnought could just come into here. That would be a fucking nightmare. I'm confused what happened there. Maybe the lab was lost beforehand and the panel just come out and it looked like it. But I thought I heard an explosion. Yeah. Yeah. Nice marsh. I suppose for Zassi, he didn't know what else to chrono. Uh, I'm not sure what else he... What, what, would he, what would you have done there, Andy? Different, maybe. Just to keep these Rockies going. I'm not sure that's a good dive. We'll get the radar. I suppose it stops the battle app coming back up. And that's not out of this game yet. There's a lot of rhinos here, as strong as BFs are, and some people say they're so overpowered and ridiculous, but these rhinos will overwhelm. Nice control. Rockies won't get any joy up there. Need to move these uh, grizzlies in, there we go. Needs to just split up as much as he can here. I'm not sure going for this MCV, like, will he get it? He might get it. But there is a service depot. Oh, well, he could have stayed there then. I'm sure he could have stayed there and had that. There is a service depot anyway. Maybe that's just heard me in commentary say that then and I dived out. He did get it now. Um, just he, he just needs to keep doing as much work in his BS. And he is getting joy here. The chronosphere is ready again. Power drop there. Doesn't want to overcommit though too much with the miners coming in. I don't know why Zas just threw all of that away. Keep one alive. Oh my god. No way. Misses the um, misses the elite as well. So uh, three chronos from Zas and three kind of poor chronos. Must be said. I um, think if, if there were better chronos on the field here, this would be a, a different story to tell. I see he's ready. There is some drones on the field as well. No battle lab. Um, there's no MCV. We can rebuild the MCV if he wishes to, but... Um, drone's going to come in. Going to icy drones, these, these grizzlies. Which will clear up a, a, a huge amount of this army. Needs to get these NG IFBs over. Ah. Uh. Oh, save seven. Needs to move that again. The elite coming over now. And he's just overwhelmed here. With rhinos and with there being an elite there as well. Just baits him in there. Really nice. Um, little play there from Legend, but it was very comfortable. So many more rhinos too. Grizzly there. Really interesting game. I don't think it. Zas is like a nine years Andy playing Brutal. <laughs> uh, I veto the shit, the shit map. Yeah, I have kind of played Vita before, and I was, I did have it Vita this month, but then I needed to Vita I know a couple of other maps, so then I, I put this one back on. Um, but I have just put Divide and Conquer back on, and I'm gonna play that as Yuri. I used to play that as Allied, and my win ratio on that must have been dog shit. Um, Zas, I'm gonna wall his. MCV. Yeah, it does notice it straight away. Um, so those of you who don't know this map, Dawn of Prowl is, is a really, really high eco map. There's so much ore and gems. So you start with gems here and you'll build down to these gems here and you can build up to these gems. Then once you get into the middle, you can just see the, the four corners, a combination of lots of ore and a combination of lots of gem in the middle as well. Now France player will look to try and take map control with the cannons. And um, Zaslan can't lose any more games or this series will go to Legend. It is a map if you're, if you're playing as allied that um, you, the only good thing is you can afford to to go uh, a seal or double NG earlier, and if you do lose them, it's not completely the worst, I guess, because you still got the eco behind it. But um, 
I, I mean, there's probably a counter argument to that. Is, um, but yeah, that, it's not like Country Swing where if you fuck up a seal early on, then you almost lost the game. Um, Legend with a uh, two miners up onto the top right hand side and the gems. Two miners on this left hand spot here as well. Imagine he'll look to get a war factory into here, then a ref into here somewhere and get onto these gems as well. No really reason early on to, to mine too much ore. Um, and kind of want to keep on top of these gems early. No seal this time. Oh, Zass. Yeah, I hate country swing. Well, I don't hate country swing. It's. It's um, it's quite a boring open in three minutes. But I suppose you, it's good to have maps like that where it isn't just you can um, you've got unlimited cash and do what you want. So yeah, uh, this this rock is going to go down. So let's have a count of the the miners. One, two, three, four, five, six. Needs to get this one onto the gem. So we'd be sending another miner down here. Two of them onto the gems. Let's look what Legend is doing. Yeah, so this miner on ore, that's not good. One, two, three, four rhinos versus four grizzlies. A couple of flags behind that, but um, with the defensive hold, no issue there as well. And Service Depot comes out as well. Time to get this miner onto the gems as well. You can just go in there and defend that. I don't know why he's lost. With the, the help of the miners there. Yeah, so that's just been a little bit passive there. Costing himself a miner. Um, I haven't said that now. That's maybe a bad call because he's lost all his army. <laughs> Hope he uh, commentator. Uh, gets another ref out. Uh, he needs he needs some grizzlies here. It's all good with having these cannons to help himself defend, but nice shot on the Harry there. He's got these rockies to work. The rockies to work. Get the rockies to work. So it does lose the radar. Battle lab is up there for legend. There's the IC. So Legend on 6.5k. Zass is on 7k as well. Still the one war factory. Um, battle Lab. He goes for a Battle Lab. That's interesting. I wouldn't mind of seeing another war factory before the Battle Lab. Seal ready. Seal now comes out as well. He's going to um, want to harass these, the IC and the Nuka together. So it'll be a bunker in either of these positions that will slow that right down. Uh, I want to get a ref up into here shortly. There's still Sass is um, not in not in too bad a position, but I think with this IC I like where Legends at. Oh, Gonna go for the lab. Does four shield. Get a war factory. Not too bad at all. Needs to be careful of these flak. I'm gonna lose all these rockies. There we go. Don't wanna lose all your rockies. For, for a war factory. Let's get a war factory, puts him back on two war factories. Puts a gap generator in the back here. Um, not sure. I think I would like to see the forward gap. Um, does send out a drone. You're going to IC drone? Going to IC drone and then look to come in with rhinos. Tanya comes out. A couple of NGIFEs would be nice help against these drones. I can just shoot in a patch of the ore there so we can get the ref down, I believe. Got the service depot. I want to use the service depot. We can save a couple. Maybe one or two. Let's get some mirages there as well. Scary army. There is some mirages. 
Cannon comes out. Gonna look to come up on this side here. Zas has the um has the eco. Legend on 7k. He's now gonna try and come in. Tanya does Does he get another miner? Shoot that miner! There we go. Okay, so he gets a wolf factory in on miner for the Tanya. That's nice. That's a good bit of joy there as well. Nuclear missile on the field here for Legend. 7k in the bank for Mr. Legend. Zaslan on 2k. Just a one wall factory still. Can I move the MCV? Just the one war factory though. Just one more factory. Hero reporting. Nice use of the Rockies. Doesn't want to over. Okay, gotta come out now. Have a look, that MCV goes up to there. Let's see how well this IC can do. Just gets the bad lab there. And the MCV comes out. Service, it still has the service of that MCV coming out at just the worst possible time. We'll save this. We'll save this. Does save that MCV. Does lose the other MCV that comes out, but uh, Kirov coming up the top side here. Still just one war factory, though. Tanya. Gets a miner. Can get a second one. Kirov gonna do work, chat. Let's get another miner. This Kirov is under-tested. The Kirov, you can just bring your your Rockies. This Kirov is under tested. This is this is gonna be huge. It's gonna expansion. Oh, not good, not good. That for Sass. I think he's lost the game now. There's no new uh, super weapons on the field as well. The next IC is now gonna be ready. I wouldn't mind like. Harry is as well. Um, okay, he's lost the radar now. Just one war factory. Still one war, war factory versus one. And I mean, Legend's done well. He's on 23k, but I feel like um, Zas could have maybe achieved more this game. comes out, battle that back up. Uh, I think if I was a uh, legend here, I would rebuild the MCV. There we go. The MCV is rebuilt. We've obviously lost to the Tanya previously. Here comes the nuclear missile. Just take the battle lab. Or do you go for all of that? Okay, that's at the battle lab. Um, just wondered if you maybe shot four power plants and maybe got the radar. MCV is back over to that side there now. And uh, there's no reason here for Legend to even bother with a ref there. I would, I would just be going war factory after war factory. But just long distance for a little while. A lot of Rockies in the field. There's another war factory. So two wars. Black Cannon comes out either side there as well to stop that. He needs a war factory. So that's land on 10k. He has this ore patch here to mine. Uh -oh. Eco so silly in Yuri. This this map is stupid. If it was RA2, it would be the same as well. I know it looks more enhanced, but uh, there's just so much eco on this map. It's It's incredible. I see comes out. Try to keep an eye on what's happening. Or oh, runs right across. Doesn't get any joy there. Comes up on this side. Could take the war factory here in the service depot. What? Is... I'm not sure. Get the nuke. That was a free nuke. Oh, the force shield comes out. Again, uh, I think uh, I think it Andy there gets gets more done with with them two seals. Um, so just a one more factory versus one, two, three, four, five, five now. 
Now he'll just be overwhelmed here. If I'm if I'm legend, they just keep building flat cannons around my base. Now I'd have a flat cannon in there as well until he moves up to here. And and that's is um, and that's is in big trouble here now. Whoa, there we go. The nuclear missile does go down this time. Just caught that on the corner as well. So another seal lands. Um, so the nuclear missile does go down. We have an IC again. Um. I would, I would like to see him come into here. I think that's where the plan is, isn't it? Oh, that's nice as well. And I think the legend here, I mean, he's got so many options, but one of the key things is, is just to constrict these two spots here. Uh, I think we'll see GG being called now. GG Gs. Oh, all of these Rockies, look at them. There we go, chap. There we go. Nothing else happening. No war factory, no MCV. Just left with a barracks raid on battle lab. No more production apart from Harriet's. Yeah, yeah, and that was the thing. When that was the thing. Legend at one point was on one war factory, um, and and the middle control from from Zass, He had the cannons. He, I mean, he had this spot here. He had this spot here. Is versus one war factory, and um, like he said, um, Zas probably should have should have converted that. Uh, thank you very much again, Larry, uh, for all the biddies for sponsoring this series. It's been a really good series, though. Um, Legend with a final score of six games to three. Thank you for all your comments as well.